Hi friends, welcome to Jyoti Foods. Today we will cook boti with red sorrel leaves. For this, this is half kg boti. This is 250 grams red sorrel leaves. We, we call it as ambada in Hindi and gongura in Telugu. Garam masala powder, ginger garlic paste, dhania powder, red chilli powder, tomatoes, salt, turmeric powder, green chillies, small garlic pod, jeera. These are again few green chillies few coriander leaves, chopped onion and this is for garnishing, coriander leaves. Now we will start the recipe. In a pressure cooker, add 5 tablespoons of oil. When the oil gets heated, we will add onion, curry leaves and green chillies. While the onions are frying in a other bowl, we will add green chillies, garlic, cumin seeds and This red sorrel leaves. We will add half a glass water and we will boil this. We will add half a glass water and we will cook this for 5 to 10 minutes. Here we can see our onions are fried and translucent. Now at this stage we will add ginger garlic paste. We will fry till the raw smell goes out from this paste. Ginger garlic paste is nicely fried. We will add salt and turmeric powder. After mixing, we will add tomato we will cook till this tomatoes get soft we can see our leaves are cooked nicely now we will switch off and let this cool completely and in a mixer jar we will make a puree. Our tomatoes are also cooked. Now I will add boti. Cook for 5 minutes without pressure. After 5 minutes we can see the water oozed out from this boti. Now we will pressure cook for 3 to 4 whistles. No need of adding water. To 
in the pressure releases take a mixy jar add the leafy cooked leafy vegetable and we will make a puree or paste of this leaves our paste is ready now the pressure is released we will add dhania powder and red chilli powder give a mix cook for 3 to 4 minutes After 3 minutes we will add the ground paste mix it nicely After mixing we will add a cup of water we will cook this till oil comes out at this stage we will check the salt and other spices too now we can see the oil has come out it means our curry is ready Now, lastly, we will add garam masala powder. Mix this. cook for another just 1 to 2 minutes our curry is ready garnish with coriander leaves our yummy gongura boti curry is ready to serve if you like my recipe try in your homes share and subscribe my channel for ingredients you can see the description box thank you